Hey there, and welcome to my latest travel vlog. Today, I'm excited to take you on a wide ride to the beautiful Madarao Mountain in Nagano Prefecture, Japan. Despite the heavily snowstorm and the freezing temperature of minus 10 degrees, we were determined to make the most of our time on the mountain. Of course, our trip wouldn't be completed without experiencing some of the local cuisine and drinks. So join me as I take you on a wild ride through Madarao Mountain. And who knows, maybe you'll be inspired to plan your own snowy adventure. We did some research and came across the orionski.jp website. We offer some amazing deals for skiing and snowboarding trips in Japan. You can use Google Translate in the site. After browsing through their package, we choose Hotel Madame Mireille, which offer great deal that included a Shinkansen ride, a hotel stay for one night, and lift tickets for around 23,500 yen. Here is information from booking.com. While it wasn't a luxury hotel, it was a great value for the price. The day of our snowboarding adventure had finally arrived. We met up with our group of friends bright and early at 6.30 a.m. in Ueno, ready to catch the Shinkansen to Nagano. After a couple of hours on the train, we arrived in Nagano at 9.30 a.m. From there, we hopped on a bus to take us to our hotel in Madarao Mountain. The snow was falling quite heavily and we couldn't wait to hit the slopes. Once we arrived at the hotel, we quickly checked in Whoa. and the room was spacious. It provided everything we needed, including comfortable futon and a warm heater to keep us cozy during the cold winter night. <laughs> Hôm nay có những cái gì đây? Có một cái tivi nhỏ nhỏ Tivi À, rất là nhiều mốc chia Bên này thì có gì? Máy xử lấy Và phu tông đẹp nhất The staff was very friendly with good English They have board, ski, rental and other accessories such as globes, google Also lift is included So after everything is ready it was time to hit the slope. After a few hours of snowboarding in the heavy snowstorm, we were exhausted and starving. That's when we stumbled upon Haiti, a restaurant located conveniently near the super wide lift. Not only did it offer food, but also lift tickets, rentals, and vending machines. It was the perfect spot to take a break from the cold and recharge. The dining room was spacious and comfortable. The food lineup wasn't so crowded, and we quickly made our way to the ordering counter. I ordered the pork catalogue ramen, while my wife went for the beef curry.
After a long day of snowboarding, we were excited to get back to our hotel and unwind. We took a relaxing bath and soak our tired muscles in the hot tub. But the highlight of the evening was definitely dinners. Hotel Maramire offered an all-you-can-eat dinner hot pot for only 1,000 yen. On the second day of our trip, we woke up to a typical Japanese breakfast at the hotel. Unlike the previous day, the snowfall was not as heavy, and we got to enjoy a sunny day with a clear view of the mountain. The snowboarding conditions were perfect, and we had blast on the slopes. Before taking the Shinkansen bullet train back to Tokyo, we made a stop at the secret Izakaya's restaurant on the first floor of Iyama Station. The restaurant was cozy and intimate with a traditional atmosphere that felt authentic and welcoming. Thank you for watching our travel vlog to Madarao Mountain in Nagano Prefecture. We hope our experience inspire you to take your own adventure and explore all that this beautiful world has to offer. Who knows, you may just discover your next favorite destination. Until next time, happy travels!